Hello and welcome to another video and today is another opinionated video and I'm talking about drum roll please YouTube yeah I've made a hundred million videos about YouTube by this point but today I'm just gonna talk about this because this is crazy and it's it's not a good change at all that YouTube have done right now it's a change to the algorithm and it's terrible to be fair so basically every time a YouTuber uploads a video they lose subscribers and I've went through this first hand as well because with my previous video which you should go check out by the way uh, about the crazy teacher who tried to take down my YouTube video oh yes self promotion is in this video guys I'm sorry about that yeah about in that video right literally Straight after it, I lost two subscribers, and I know that's not a lot to you guys, you know, you YouTube professionals getting like a billion subscribers a day, in it? But like, it is for me. Um, so I was like, why? What have I done wrong with my content? Like, is there anything wrong with me? And I was questioning myself, like, maybe this content is not the type of thing my viewers want. They might not want that a new bit of content, like a different type of thing, changing things up. But then I looked at the views and I was like, you know what, what the fuck, the views are good, you know. And also the likes to dislike are very good. You know, I'm like, why then? What's going on? And then I couldn't solve this mystery, right? I couldn't solve it at all. Until your boy, Comedy Shorts Gamer, uploaded a video about YouTube and the algorithm that makes him lose subscribers every time he uploads literally it's straight away once a video goes out i start losing subscribers now at first i thought maybe i was generally just losing subscribers maybe people just didn't like my content now but this has been happening for the past two weeks now so now I, i'm something it's 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 a bit weird because like with a video being up 40 seconds and I'm already losing 20 subscribers, that doesn't really make sense. So now, anyway, I decided I'm gonna record my live count. This is, let me show you well, right now, my live count. This is from when I just uploaded. As you can see, it's slowly going down. But then, all of a sudden, BAM! Look at this! And I added two, to two, two and two together. And I learned how to speak as well, because I can't speak right now. <laughs> no, but I added two and two together. No, I didn't get five, I got four. And I realised that fucking YouTube was fucking up with an algorithm. And it wasn't my content at all. So I went and looked over everybody's social blade and realised that everybody has been taking a hit in views and subscribers over the most recent month where this change probably happened, right? And I was like, you know what, this is just terrible. Because, like, you don't, you might not know this, but YouTube... To people is like an inspiration and a passion and when when like you don't do well at that and you feel like you're failing like it is not a good thing to feel okay it's definitely not a good thing to go through especially for the veterans of YouTube like the people who've been in this site for over eight years at this bitch they would get really disheartened by this type of shit okay it is not good at all also 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 on the topic of YouTube fucking up they also have this stupid shit with suggestions, right? And stupid shit with suggestions. Where I once got suggested a thing about the B movie, right? But every time they say B, it gets two times faster. Yeah, legit, legitimately, that's what I've been getting. Oh man, I'm so pumped for this quality ass content. Let's get right into this shit. Mm-hmm. Cool, it seems really good so far. Don't kill me right now. This, this is amazing. The quality of this shit. Yeah. This is what gets you 11 million views, people. This. Is it weird that I'm contemplating life right now? Jesus Christ. Like, what the fuck is this? Okay, you know what? This is enough. Okay. Yeah, I I'm just gonna click out of this shit. Because fucking hell. Fucking hell. 
that was an experience that I don't think I'll ever have again. Very, very, very unique experience right there. Like, what the fuck is the point of that? What are YouTube thinking I'm into right now, okay? I'm not into that type of shit. I'm more into, like, gaming and stuff. They should know this because that's, like, they, they take the videos that you watch and they get similar videos from the algorithm. But obviously, it's just not working anymore. They've not, it's just fucked up, right? And then PewDiePie himself uploaded on Twitter, tweeted, right, that he got suggested porn, right? It's just, YouTube, if I had one message to you, one message to you at all, it would be to fuck, fix your shit. I nearly said fuck your shit. No, don't fuck your shit because that would, that would make things worse. You know, don't fuck yourself, man. But yeah, it it could get even worse than this, you know. If we're looking into a future here, you could see all these great content creators like the people who don't clickbait. And I've defended clickbaiting in the past, you know. If it's kind of relevant to what you're going to be talking about, you know. That's fine, I would say. But, like, there's going to be people making misleading titles, type of clickbait and shit. And that's just not okay. Just because YouTube is really fucking up, man. It's, like, really fucking up. And it could affect the whole website. could affect the type of content on this website. And it could go back into an era of just clickbait. And I thought we got out of it mainly. You know, we've got a few lispy jimmies here and there. We've got a few um, exilities. But, you know... Uh, Overall, I think we're fine on clickbait right now. I think it's alright. I, I can manage it, you know. But if YouTube doesn't fix its shit, people will only be going for their views, you know. They won't be just going with the content they'd love to make. They'll just be going for views. And by that, they'll have to put asses in the title when they're really doing something about a fucking bloody b unboxing video or some shit. Put asses in the thumbnail and all this shit. Whoring out the views. And it's in this case, it's not their fault, you know, because if they're losing subs that they don't even deserve to lose, they probably will have to do that, you know, to gain them back and shit. But all of this stems from just YouTube, man. YouTube could kill itself. And I'm not saying that a website as big as YouTube could die off completely, but I'm saying it could, like, really just, like, lose popularity. It could, like, go into like just not it's not relevant anymore you know it could go to unrelevancy and it could go to just shit they really need to make a good update change to be fair oh yeah i forgot to mention yeah um, i left that one positive feature of the uh, youtube update type thing they do let you pin comments on the videos like the favorite comment but you have, like, you see a comment you think is worthy of being up there, you can pin it to the top. So, like, they, there's not going to be, like, any memes at the top, like, like, uh, like or you'll die or some shit. Like my comment or you'll die or something crazy. So, yeah, that is a good addition. Now, back to the old talking stupid extract plays. Bam. But you know what, this has just been a serious video, you know, you don't expect to see an extract plays video being serious. You know, you normally just see me messing around and joking, but I have I have to sometimes, you know, talk about this type of shit because it does piss me off. I want to make people aware of it if they're not, because you must have been living under a rock if you um, haven't already heard about this though. You must have been. But I just want to give it out there just in case you haven't heard about all this shit, and if you're a fellow YouTuber like me, you can tell me in the comments if you have ever lost subs after uploading a video and if this change is um, relevant to you. Because it certainly is for me, certainly is for a load of people I know and a load of massive YouTubers even. So yeah, that's basically the video. And uh, just one note, one note to plus onto it, you know, one note. Yeah, uh, Rocket League, you know, is always in the background in my videos. You know, it's coming like an iconic scene type of thing now. You're just used to it. Extract plays Rocket League, you know, it, they, they match up. But if you want, you can comment a game that I could put in the background, right? That isn't Rocket League. Because I, I do understand, like, you know, with the CSGO surfing um, meme that went on in the 
commentary community at one point, I'm now be Overwatch shit. Um, well, yeah, that, that got stale, and um, I don't really want my videos to get stale visually. Like, I don't, I don't know if my videos will be stale like um, verbally though, because like that's up to me. You know, if I'm if I'm ill like I am now, it might not be up to scratch, and you know, but if it's not, then you know you should you should be enjoying it but like and visually is just as important as anything else so if you want a game that you want to see on this channel just comment it down and like my video and you could come in with a chance of like seeing your favorite game on my channel you know even if i haven't bought it i'll probably have to buy it you know because i'm like that i'm a gentleman for the viewers <laughs> yeah okay yeah but other than that it's nearly got to 10 minutes you know the extra ad revenue other than that, uh, thanks for watching this video. If you liked it, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Keep extracting, and fuck YouTube.